Uh, Harmony Movement is thrilled to announce this year's winner of the Harmony Award and presenting tonight's Harmony Award is our local friendly, I already introduced him, uh, and now magazines soon to be voted Toronto Best City Councillor, Joe Cressy of Ward 20, Trinity Spadina. So I work at City Hall and I'm here to announce that I'm endorsing Joanne for mayor of this city in the next election. <laughs> Rather, that was one heck of a speech, no doubt. Listen, I am truly, truly honored to be here along so many impressive individuals and organizations, and it is an absolute privilege to present the 2017 Harmony Award. And we're going to be presenting it to an exceptionally impressive organization, and that's Unity Mosque. If you don't know Unity Mosque, you should. Since they formed in 2009 to provide an inclusive Muslim prayer space, a place where inclusion was at the heart of it, where people, regardless of gender, of sexual orientation, of race, of even language, a place where inclusion and people could come together, where people of different faiths could even come together. That's Unity Mosque. Unity Mosque has not only provided this space of spiritual healing for everybody in our city. But they've gone so far, they've spawned a movement. There are nine, nine similar places now across North America because of unity. So why is this important? So we talk about in our city, right here in Toronto, that diversity is our strength. Diversity is just a fact. Inclusion is a choice. That's the key here. Inclusion takes work. It takes effort. It means we have to create those spaces. Create the spaces that Unity Mosque has created where people can feel welcome. Otherwise, it's just diversity without meaning. And so we live, we live in very perilous times. With the rise of hatred and xenophobia and Islamophobia south of the border, increasing inequality here, a lot of forces are dividing us, but Unity Mosque brings us back together. So today, right now in fact, more than ever, Unity Mosque is critical in our collective healing, and it is my absolute privilege to present the 2017 award to Unity Mosque. Could Troy and uh, Elfra come on up? Unity Mosque, everybody. Alaikum, everybody. I'm El Farouk. My name is Troy Jackson. And this is Tajali Moon Dragon Khaki Jackson. And he's five months old today. And we're inviting all of our congregation members who are here, whether you're out or in the closet about being a member of Unity Mosque, to step up. <laughs> Join us. If you want to read my words, you can read them in the program. I'm just going to spell something out for you here right now, okay? It goes like this.
So um, he's the singer, I'm the speaker. Um, <laughs> love is what it's all about. Um, in my daytime work as a refugee lawyer, I have been witness to uh, what I describe as spiritual trauma. Um, and it's not a Muslim only thing, it's something that many of us who come from faith traditions, whatever that faith tradition experience, because we're told we're not good enough, whether we're because of the color of our skin or of our gender or of our genitalia or our sexual orientation or our class or our disability or whatever it is. And so the Unity Mosque was created. Uh, it's open to everybody. You don't have to be Muslim identified. And there are many people who come to us uh, who, who do not identify as Muslim, but as a place of spiritual healing. Um, Allah in the Quran in chapter 49, 13 tells us that we were created into different nations and tribes that we may know each other. Uh, part of the problem for us as Muslims is that we don't actually know ourselves. And um, so this is also a place for where Shia and Sunni and all sorts of people, no matter who you are or how you identify. And just as a, as a sidebar, if anyone's afraid about um, the Muslim takeover, it's too late, we're already here. Uh, <laughs> And we've been here for a very, 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 very long time. Islam, Islam first came to Turtle Island um, with African descent Muslims. Um, and there are records that indicate that uh, indigenous people of Turtle Island also came into Islam through this initial contact hundreds and hundreds of years ago. Um, their blood still flows in this land. Um, and it flows in our movement and in our memory. Um, and we're here to stay. And we open our doors. We thank you for this award and for the recognition of the work that we do because um, love is about transformation. It's about transforming our hearts and it's about transforming our world. Um, and that's what Unity Mosque's agenda is. It is our gay agenda. Um, and so, <laughs> so I invite you to join us. We meet every Friday um, in downtown Toronto. Uh, we, you won't be forced to do anything you don't want. Just come in and spend some time with us and be transformed, inshallah. Thank you. Assalamu alaikum. Yeah.